One more person may be coming from Quebec to join us here in the Philippines. You know who you are, Chris. At this rate, we may need to call this Quebec in the Philippines. There is another person from the UK with letters JJ who told me he would love to come here to the Philippines after seeing all these videos behind me of how life is like where we are living and working in Eastwood City. Will you join us next? There is a yet another person who told us that his name begins with the letter A from the United States that may be coming very soon to the Philippines. Will you be next? My personal goal is to have 100 people from abroad come here to the Philippines to live and work with us, with me, with the team, with everyone at Freedom who is headquartered here in the Philippines. We have an office and we have 20,000 square feet of office space that we're moving into in two months to expand. We have potentially a school that's two. <laughs> that school, if it starts, will start with preschool, where we will invite everyone who's preschool to come study at our center. It will not be called the George Venus Institute of International Learning, most likely. That was a suggestion by Brita. If you look behind me, that's his comment where he suggested that name. Thank you, Brita. You rock for making that suggestion. The Philippines is a lifestyle. This is not just working for freedom. This is not just building the best network on YouTube. This is discovering who you are by exploring a new culture where you can focus on finding new friends, building new relationships to really find out who you're going to be in life. One of my personal goals is to help people discover themselves because I discovered myself when I came to Taiwan. Back in 2008, as some of you know, I decided to leave North America, get on a jet plane, and head on over to Taiwan because I had the idea of promoting Asian singers outside of Asia who sang well in English. In Taiwan, I met my future wife, Xiaoyu, and that changed my life. I think many of you may be looking for a special someone, and I think many of you are looking to build your career. I hope moving to the Philippines will help you accomplish both goals. Our second recruit, Doug, aka Sata, has told me he is the happiest he's ever been because he came to the Philippines. He's been to the US, he's from Australia, and he's done a variety of jobs, but he's never found something that makes him so happy as now. And I hope he'll make a video talking about that from his own personal experience. I would love to have you join us. If you think you can be more productive here in the Philippines, if you think you can meaningfully contribute to helping freedom grow, to helping yourself grow, and to helping everybody grow together. If you think so, then head on over to our new job site, jobs.freedom.tm, which is linked down there in the description below. That is where you can apply to come to the Philippines by submitting your plan, submitting who you are professionally so we can make a better decision. My goal is to get a hundred of you over here in the next, in this year, 2015. Can you be part of that 100? Let's find out. <laughs> who am I? I am George, CEO and founder of Freedom. And you've been watching The George Show. If you really look at yourself, you will be speechless. What happened to being doctors and teachers? What happened to being your brother's keeper? Nowadays, keep